this bench wise assembly today we are going to see how to make this jaw screw so let's make it first open cut yeah then go on start then mechanical design and then part design right here uh, as a jaw screw and after that you have to select any plane from here and then go on sketch option from there now we have two types we can make this jaw by two type you can make one circle here then second on that on second third on that and fourth on that but uh, for simple method you can use just uh, you have to just make it half and you we can use the shaft command to rotate it so i am using the second one so let's make i am making it step by step you can also make it this is how our half sketch is ready so let's go dimensions by using this constraint option so the given length from this to this end is given as 138 so it is 138 now now distance between this to this line is given as 24 so it's 24 now now distance between uh, this this line to this line distance between this line to this line is given as 10 so write here 10 and enter it again now our next part is distance between this line to this line is given as 82 and after that similarly from this to this is given as uh, it is given as 7 and again from this to this is given as 6 and the one line is remaining it will take dimensions automatically now let's give dimensions so this external line to this central axis dimension is given as 12 divided by 2 that is 6 then from this line is given as 8 divided by 2 that is 8 divided by 2 that is 4 now this external line to the central axis is given as 18 that is 18 divided by 2 is 9 and this is how our whole sketch is ready it is full in green color So after that, go on exit to workbench. Then use this uh, shaft command. Then select the axis on which you want to rotate it. I'm selecting this. Uh, it's not selecting from here. Then you can select it from here. But I will use this. Sorry. it selected and then click on okay after that you have to make one hole so first select the x select the plane and then go on sketch option from here after that we want to hole here we want to make one hole here so first use this hole command it is at the center you can say it's taking center automatically and make one hole of radius 6 so use this constraint option to give diameter its diameter diameter 6 and then go on uh, no no we have to give dimensions the distance between first select constraint option distance between this external line to the center of the circle is given as 12 and then click on okay after that go on exit to workbench and then we have to use this pocket command we want pocket to both sides so use here mirror extend and click on okay this is how we have completed our uh, jaw screw thank you so much guys for watching it